Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of MLB 07 The Show featuring the 2018 Boston Red Sox. I am Jose the Sports Gamer back with another video. So this is the last episode of this series. It is the World Series ladies and gentlemen. And we are facing the San Diego Padres. Now, just like last episode, I'm just going to simulate the games, uh, most of the games, and just going to play the last one of the series where we're gonna, we might actually win the series. Or, if we are in an elimination situation, then we're going to play the games remaining to actually win the series. So, let's get this series started. And let's go to this game. And I don't give a damn about this. A triple A should actually be ending the actually, excuse me, actually ending it already. And we lose a game. The first game. Lose the second game. We win the third. We're at home. Oh my. The Padres. How can the Padres do this to us? I mean, it doesn't really make sense. Like, what the hell, man? It is a Padres we're talking about, man! You know, the, the, these Padres have brought the Stephen A. Smith personation on me, like, the Padres? Like, what the hell, man? Like, it's blasphemous that the Padres are the ones winning this series. Like, no, we're gonna play all the games remaining. This is gonna be a long video. Stay tuned. For baseball, we welcome you to legendary Fenway Park in Boston, as that'll be the site for this edition of Major League Baseball. Coming up, exclusive coverage of Game 5 of this year's World Series for you here, as it'll be the San Diego Padres taking on the Boston Red Sox. Exactly where this thing is. So a runner on first with one out now, and digging in is the young first baseman, Adrian Gonzalez. And that's in there for a strike. Boy, they could really use a double play ball here. But a strikeout wouldn't be too bad either. Come on, let's have them regret that they even made the World Series oh, strikeout. Up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. A lot of pitching coaches will tell you if you can spot the fastball there early in the ball game, you're going to be successful. Just perfect location right there. Russell Brennan will be the batter. And that misses ball one. And he's going to need to rein that one in a bit because he'll get beat if he keeps leaving pitches up. In the dirt, and now let's see. Swing and a miss on the heater, and it's two and one. This one's low here, so the count swells to three and one. Swung on and missed three and two. Oh, I'm gonna come to any inning. Come to any inning. You're a fastball. Swung on and missed for strike three, and the inning is over. So no run. Number 50 will step in now. Swing and a ball driven Come on, go, 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 go. That ball's gone. Chased, but this one is gone. A home run. So a two-run shot to left center. His second home run of the series. And that gives the Red Sox a two-to-nothing lead. Well, the key here is he gets this ball airborne to left center because that thing barely had enough carry to get out of here. Number 28 will take his first cut to the ball game here. And here's a fastball called for strike one. And one and one as this one's in on the hands. Oh, that ball's gone. J.D. Martinez with the, the ball. And it's a home run. So it's a solo shot to dead center. His second home run of the series. As it's now a 3-0 ball game. Well, 
sometimes when things are going bad, everything just starts to snowball on you. Kind of like a domino effect. Your mind's still thinking about the last home run, so you lose concentration to this guy. Can't do Todd Walker steps in now. And a first pitch slider is right there for strike one. Yeah, let that thing go. Still got a couple more strikes to play with. And he watches one dip low and inside for a ball, one and one. Fastball called strike, one and two. Slowly down the line to third. Could be a tough play. Foul. Doesn't matter how hard you throw it, a well-placed heater is still the best pitch in baseball. And look where this thing is, right on the inside corner. That's a tough pitch. Marcus Giles will dig in here. Down the line and just fouled, says the umpire who was right on top of it. This misses the outside corner, so it's knotted up at one and one. Trying to backdoor him, but it stays outside just a bit. And this one's not even close to the strike zone. It's past the catcher for ball two. Taken, strike two called, and it's even at two and two. Sit down, boo. Fastball swung on and missed, and that is out number three. Three up, three down for San Diego. They trail in this one, three nothing. Down in order go the Red Sox, but they're on top by a count of three to nothing. Mike Cameron is the batter now as he looks at a bowl of one and zero. Oh. Looked like a breaking ball there, but it missed badly, 2-0. Oh. Well, he's got that thing falling right through the zone here. And this one finds the corner for strike one. I think he held up in time, but that becomes moot as it's a cold strike two. Fastball is outside. It's full now, 3-2. Josh Bard waits on deck. Yeah. Fastball swung on and missed for the first down. Number 16 will bat here. No official at bat, but he's scored a run thus far. Sinker runs outside to start the at bat, 1-0. Swinging a ground ball towards the middle. Nope. Just it. past his outstretched glove for a base hit. Not a bad location there. Inside part of the play. Khalil Green will stand in now to get us going here in the fourth. And that misses low and away. Ball one. He'll try a different arm slot here to see if he can get him to chase. Swing and a miss as he ramps up on the fastball. One and one. Side two and one. And the pitch. In there, two and two. Sit down, boom, strike out. Slider, and that's out number one. Boy, that's a beauty right there. As a hitter, you see fastball out of his hand, then boom, it's gone. Great pitch. The head time as he reaches it first. So it's first and third with two away, and in steps the second baseman Marcus Giles. And now we'll see some action in the bullpen as the lefty starts to get loose. Lays off one and zero. Oh. And this winds up inside for a ball two and zero oh now. And that's a good location coming back at his body there. And he gets this one over at the knees for the first strike. Swing and a miss there, and it's two and two. 
2 pitch on the way. And a Yo, big folks, sit down. There, they'll leave a couple of runners on base, and after a good start to the inning, they can't capitalize any further. Tremel Sledge will stand in. 0 for 2 thus far. And this one's hit on the ground, but foul. And there's ball one. And he's starting to get up there in pitches now. Worth keeping an eye on. Fouled back. Girl. And he struck him out. And that's eight strikeouts thus far. Padres down in order. Score holds. It's three to one. First, he has put up nothing but zero since. Number 19 will dig in. 0 for 1 here in this one. And he lays off there, 1 and 0. Outside locator that time, but a good job to lay off. Here's the 1 0. Now a ball hit hard. Towards <laughs> and that'll get down for a base hit. Have a look. The catcher sets the target down around the knees, but this is a good low ball hitter, and he gets good wood on this one. Mike Adams is on, and he'll take over on the mound. Number 50 will dig in. One for two, including a home run thus far. And there's his strike right down the heart of the plate, 0-1. Well, he got away with that pitch, but when you're a veteran pitcher, those are the kind of location mistakes you just can't afford to make. Now a ball hit hard towards the hole. And that is into right field, a base hit. And you know, when you're trailing in a ball game, the last thing you want <laughs> to the gap in left center for extra bases. Runner at second, one away. And here's the shortstop, Khalil Green. And he lays off a fastball. Looked good, but it's 1-0. Oh. Hits are even right now at 5 aside. Boy, that fastball is just sizzling up there. 1-1. One and, one. and this one gets away, and it ought to be scored a passed ball. But surprisingly, no advance here. Well, they got away with one there. I don't understand at all why there was no advance there. A 2-1 offering. Grounded foul toward the coaching box at third. Runner at second here with one man out. This one sinks low and a touch outside. It's a full count, three and two. Adrian Gonzalez yes. is on deck. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. Well, sometimes hitters can have problems picking up the baseball in night games. Not giving him any excuses, but it is a possibility. So a runner at second, two down now, and now the left-handed hitting Adrian Gonzalez will get a shot. And he lays off a pitch in there for the first strike. Boy, tough pitch right out of the chute in this at bat. Fastball that time is nowhere close, and it's even at one and one. And he lays off a pitch down and away, ball two. Two out here and a runner at second. And he misses low here, so the count goes to three and one. The three and one pitch. And this is down at the knees, but called a strike. Wow, it's three and two now. And this is going to be a foul ball in amongst the spectators. Down the line, but this will kick foul. Here he struck him out with a two-seamer, and the inning is over. Padres leave one, and it remains number 16. Will step in, one for two with a walk thus far. Way late on the fastball for strike one. That was a Linda Ronstadt fastball, blew by you. Swing and a ball lied hard towards short. In there, a base hit. Number 50 will be the batter. Two for three with a home run thus far. 
First pitch coming. And this is taken outside for ball one. And now we'll see the infield shift into double play depth right here. 2-0. Swing shot back up the middle. And Cameron can't get to it. A base hit. A couple of guys on base here as they look to perhaps get a few insurance runs here in the late innings. Number 28 will try it again. He homered back in the first inning of this one. On the ground to second base. This could be two. And that's past the diving infielder for a base hit. And the runner will score from second. And Matt, that's just a good swing there. We talk about it a lot. When you drive the ball right back up the middle, it means you are on it. And he certainly was there. Number 18. We'll try again. 0 for 3 thus far. Right there for strike one. And these pitches better be well off the plate if you want this umpire to call the ball. He wants to make you swing. Ball one. And this is low, ball two, two and one. Curveball misses here, so a good hitter's count now to three and one. They set up away that time, but he couldn't quite hit a spot with a bender. Swing and a hard hit ball back up the middle. And a dive by Green, but he can't get to it, a base hit. Oh, that's four straight hits he's surrendered now. That's a good job by the catcher to go out there and try and calm him down. 46 will come in and pitch now. Ninth inning underway now as the first pitch is taken for a cold strike. Here's the pitch. And that misses one and one. And the catcher will just let that one go by. That's through to the backstop for ball two. Two one pitches a fastball swung on and missed two and two. And he'll be effective if he can keep that fastball down there. Goodbye. Bang, and a miss on the fastball and that's the first out. Well, there are nights as a hitter when you just don't see the ball that well, and this might be one of those nights. Brian Giles will try again. 0 for 3 thus far. Just got a piece of it as it's fouled back. And the pitch. And this ball will be chopped foul. Hero, Swing goodbye. As he ran that two-seamer right by him for the second out. Boy, and they have really taken Giles out of his game here. Not a particularly good at bat there, and he'll head back to the dugout with an offer. Todd Walker is the last chance now with two out here in the ninth. In there for strike one, 0-1. Oh Swing and a miss as Walker's in a hole here. No balls and two strikes. Down to their last strike, so they certainly have their backs up against it. And a waste pitch there, one and two. San Diego. And we get the win, baby. Well, this might not have been one for the ages, but it was still a good competitive game here, folks. That's all you can really ask for. And Soup, any World Series game is sure to have its share of highlights, but let's go back and take a look at tonight's New Era Cap heads up play of the game. Well, Matt, here's what turned out to be the decisive blow, and it came way back in the very first inning. 
This home run got him going, and they never looked back. And fellas, when you're on the big stage, Mookie Betts the is the player of the game. Three for four, a home run, and two RBIs. I will see you in the next one. We are downtown tonight at the home of the Padres, Petco Park in San Diego. As MLB The Show gets set for another edition of Major League Baseball. And will we have a champion tonight? That remains to be seen as we get ready for Game 6 of this year's World Series. As it'll be the Boston Red Sox taking on the San Diego Padre. Is the leadoff man, he's in center field. The leadoff hitter makes his way toward the plate and we are ready for baseball. And the first pitch of the ball game here is taken for a cold strike one. The pitch. Took something off there, but this is hit well anyway out to deep go, center. Go, 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 goodbye. And that ball is gone. Home run. So it's a solo home run here. Leading Starting off the up this game the right way. Second home run of the series. As the Red Sox get the game's first run, it's one to nothing. Boy, and you want to talk about getting off to a fast start. We're only two pitches into the ball game, and it's already one nothing. That's what you call making an early statement. Number 50 will get his first opportunity. Mookie now. Betts digs into the plate. And a fastball just misses for ball one. Now a ball hit high and deep out there to this left center one's field. gonna be a double at least no to go for a triple the relay throw safe but he is in there with a triple well he puts a pretty good charge into this one and sends it into the gap in left center normally that'd be two bases but he never stops and turns it into a hustle triple number 28 steps in now Here's the first pitch. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground towards second. We get a run on the board. Throw on the first in time. Two nothing. Bottom line, just drive the run in. Doesn't matter how pretty it is. That's your one job. Well done there. Number two digs in at the plate. Now a ball lined hard toward right center. And that'll fall. And we'll see here. And you know, most of the hitters in the league will have trouble with this pitch down and away, but this guy's had success there in the past, and he does it again here. Todd Green will take his first cuts of the ball game here. Now a swing and a ball hit foul to first as the first base coach had to do a little skip to my Lou there. Using the basketball here, it's And now with two strikes and two outs, he's looking square in the face of a 1-2-3 bottom of the first. Hero. And an off-speed pitch swung on and missed, and with that, the side is retired. So they're held in check here this half of the inning. On now to the top half of inning number two. So a fairly easy inning there for Jake Peavy. We'll go to the bottom half of inning number two. Boston's out in front, two to nothing. Khalil Green is the batter now as he looks at a ball, one and oh. Oh, much too tardy on the fastball, one and one. Here's the pitch. No contact there, and it's one and two. Oh, no. And a slider runs in on him as he has to lean out of the way. Here, sit down, missed for the first down. Pulled the string on him right there, and he was way too early on that changeup. Number 50 will dig in here. And a ball, 1 0. Oh. Trying to work that thing back to the outer half. Good spot. Oh. 
And this is hit hard. Base hit. Short. Let's go. And a dive by Green, but he can't get to it. A base hit. And have a look. The catcher sets the target down around the knees, but this is a good low ball hitter, and he gets good wood on this one. So no runs on a hit here, no errors, one man left on. We'll head now to the home half of inning number three. The Red Sox on top, two to nothing. Jack Cust swings and misses there, so he's down 0-1. And, and here's a fastball called for strike two. And he takes strike three called on the fastball, one gone. And we'll get a look at this from his perspective. This thing rides up and in on him, but it's in there at the letters, and he's just frozen. Jake Peavy will get his first cuts here. And he lays off there, 1-0. Oh. Swung on and missed, 1-1. One one. That fastball's in there at 89. He won't go a whole lot higher than that. And he looks at one in there, 1-2. One and two. And the pitch. Here on fastball swung on and missed, and the side is retired. Three up, three down for San Diego. They're down two to nothing. Todd Green will stride in again. He struck out swinging his first time. Starts him out with a changeup off the plate for ball one. See if they try and stay out there again. And a fastball in there for a strike. One and one. Bases are empty here with two men out. On uh, that fastball is too much for him there. One and two. Spotting that thing on the outer half. Just threw that one right by him. Here on Spoon. Sit down. Goodbye. That, the side is retired. Padres down in order. They trail things here two to nothing. Ian Kinsler will make his way towards the box to lead off the fifth. Ball one. Swing and a liner towards right center. And that might actually be a double. Around first, heading for second now. And now it'll rattle up against the wall. Oh, there's more the enough relay. space. That's going to be a triple. And he'll get there as he legs out the leadoff triple. Well, a triple's one of the most exciting plays in baseball. You're holding your breath the whole way around the bases. Good decision to turn for third there. And he's in with the leadoff triple. And doing for Boston. They're up two to nothing. First pitch on the way. Khalil Green is at the plate as he takes a cold strike one. Now a swing and a miss that time by Green as he falls behind 0-2. That misses 1-2. Yo, Bo, sit down. Sets down the number four hitter here, and you can see by the numbers, four and a third, no hits, no walks, 13 up and 13 down. He's in total command now. Jake Peavy will try it again. Set down on strikes his first time. Foul back. And, oh, you talk about getting a pitcher's call. There's one there, and it's 0-2. Inside, as he might be trying to set him up here, 1-2. And, and the pitch. Hero. And he struck him out. So it might be time to begin the countdown, as he's now gone through six innings without allowing a base hit. Padres down in order. They're still down. It's 2-0. Mike Cameron 
will stand in. He flew out his last time up. Way late on the fastball for strike one. Right on the inside part of the plate. Not much he can do with that fastball. And he misses with it one and one. Think he held up in time, but that becomes moot as it's a called strike two. Cameron's a guy that strikes out quite a bit. Let's see if he can make contact here. Off the plate that time and a little high. It's even at two and two. Hero. And he struck him out. And that's eight strikeouts thus far. But the dam number 25 will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. And he takes ball one. Swung on and missed. One and one. Well, he's shooting for the volleyball court out there with that swing. Swing and a miss. Good sinking action there. One and two. This is a glitch. I mean, that, that sounds that bad in stands. And the slider hangs on him a bit that go, time. Go, 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 go,
56 is on and he'll take over on the mound. Marcus Giles will stand in 0 for 2 thus far. And he gets a piece of it here but it's chopped foul. And this is fouled straight back. You're up, and a miss on the fastball and that's the first down. Boy, and they have really taken Giles out of his game here. Not a particularly good at bat there, and he'll head back to the dugout with an offer. Jack Cust will stand in, 0 for 2 thus far. First pitch is a slider called for a strike. Matt, let's see if that sets the tempo for the rest of the at bat. Ooh, and heads up as this is pulled foul. And this is going to be just foul down the line as that had double written all over it. Ready with another 0-2. Good waste pitch, 1 and 2. Hero. Got him. Sit down. down on strikes for the second time here tonight. And he's just starting to dig his own hole at the plate right now. That's the second time he's struck out in the ball game. And you can see on swing track, he needs to be more selective up there. And he'll put this we one get the away. win, baby. That, the ball game is over. And suit any World Series game is sure to have a share of highlights. But let's go back and take a look at tonight's New Era Cap heads up play of the game. Boy, and a good pitch to end this thing as he just couldn't get enough oomph behind that swing. Well, Matt, here's what turned out to be the decisive blow, and it came way back in the very first inning. This home run got him going, and they never looked back. And, fellas, when you're on the big stage... And you're winning Henry, the player of the game. game. Two this for four, right two home runs, did. two RBIs. Let's go game. to the decisive Matt, game of this right. series. We are downtown tonight at the home of the Padres, Petco Park in San Diego. As MLB The Show gets set for another edition of Major League Baseball. Tonight, the game that these guys have been waiting for all their lives. Game 7 of the World Series. As it'll be the Boston Red Sox taking on the San Diego Padres. Number 50 will stand in for the first time here. Now here's the first pitch. And this is low ball one. Mercy! Let's go! And now it'll rattle up against the wall. And he is in at second base with a one out double. Let's take another look as he takes advantage of the opportunity here and clobbers this thing, and that goes for an easy double. That one, and it didn't pay off for him. Number 11 will be the batter. Let's go. That's a double. And this in fact gets to the wall now. And he is in the second with a two out double. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors, and two men left on. We'll go to the bottom half of inning number two. And we are tied nothing nothing. Mike Cameron is in now as he washes a pitch for ball one. And it runs outside, so it goes to 2 0 now. Outside locator that time, but a good job to lay off. Not very aggressive there as that's down the middle for strike one. And the slider is low and inside as he just about got him there. Todd Walker is on deck. And this is down at the knees, but called a strike. Wow, it's 3 and 2 now. You're up, though. Well, this is what you call paralysis fastball. This pitcher just planted knee high on the inside corner, and there was no way for him to pull the trigger on that. 
All he could do with it was hit a ground ball for the outs. Jeff Blum stands in as he swings and misses for strike one. Grounded foul off to the right and over toward the dugout. Now a ball line foul as that's in the seats over the Padre dugout. Ready with another 0-2. Can't get him to chase. It's 1-2. and two. Doesn't have the greatest discipline up there, but even he won't go after that 0-2. Yeah. Hit, swung on and missed, and with that, the side is retired. One left for San Diego. We'll move to the third with no score. Number 50 will dig in. He doubled his last time. Now a ball hit hard towards center. And that'll get down for a base hit. No wasting any time there, Matt. He gets the fastball to begin the at-bat and just shoots it right back where it came from. Number 28 to dig in. 0 for 1 in the ballgame. Good bite to the slider, and he takes strike one. Boy, and they would love a double play ball right here. And that misses 1 and 1. Two and one. Third inning, no score to this point. From the stretch. Oh, oh and there's a drive gone. to deep left center. You can pretty much forget about this one. This is way out of here. So a two-run shot to left center, his fourth long ball of this series, and that gives the Red Sox a two-to-nothing lead. And boy, you want to talk about a pitch he could handle. This is nothing more than a room service fastball, and he's not going to miss those. Number two will dig in. 0 for 1 here in this one. First pitch to him. And that's in there for strike one. And one of the reasons this guy's been in the bigs for so long is that he knows the importance of first pitch strikes. In on the hands that time, one and one. There's a drive high in the air and deep no. to left center field. And that ball gets down out near the wall and should be extra bases. And now that one will hop over the wall for an automatic double. Number 23 will step in. He's 0 for 1 thus far. And that misses inside 1 and 0. A few more inches in, and that's a pitch he'll turn on. And that misses 2 and 0. And this is hit hard on the ground. No, and a no, dive no, 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 by no. Green, but he can't get to it. A base hit. A run is in. Pretty disciplined at bat there. They set up away, and you see he's diving at that outside corner, but winds up getting good wood on it. Adrian Gonzalez will step in. A base hit in his last time. Off the plate and away there. One ball, no strikes. And he misses again, 2-0. and oh. Swings right over the top of that one, 2-1. and one. Now the 2-1 pitch. And a strike on the fastball. So from 2-0, and oh, it's 2-2 two and two now. And an off-speed pitch swung on and missed, and with that, the side is retired. So nothing happening this time around. Three innings complete. The Red Sox on top, three to nothing.
Ryan Kinsler will stand in now to get us going here in the fourth. Swing and a liner. Base hit. Base hit. Around first on his way to second now. Well, he kicks this inning off with a bang as a leadoff double has him in business now with no. Todd Green will lead things off here in the home half of the fourth. And he goes the other way with it. Hit well, but this is a foul ball. And this one's downstairs. It's a ball and a strike. Sometimes guys get down and get the soft stuff. Not there. Inside and low, two and one. Ball three. Khalil Green will be next. Fastball in there, three and two. Get on, swung on and missed for the first down. Khalil Green steps in now. Pulls the string on that one. One strike. Now a swing and a miss that time by Green as he falls behind 0-2. Shooting for the outside corner, but he missed it one and two. Looks like he might be getting squeezed a little bit there. You're on. Strike three called, and he knew it. Two gone. Here you go on pitch track. Let's see where this thing was. Mm, yep, that's down at the knees. You got a hacker, they'll send you back. There's two strikes. Mike Cameron will dig in. 0 for 1 here in this one. 4 1. Two out, nobody on. So 1 0 now to Cameron. Ooh, and he finds his spot there. 1 and 1. Fastball close, but he didn't get it. 2 and 1. And a big swing and a miss here, two strikes. Even though that's on the outer half of the plate, he can still get around with that thing. Won't commit on the slider. Good patience, and it's full three and two. Todd Walker would be next. And here's a swing and a foul ball as that was just wide of the bag. Here's the payoff pitch. Hero. Struck him out, so he makes quick work of him here. Three straight strikeouts, and his side is retired. Three up, three down for San Diego. Still down, three nothing. Number 18 will dig in. 0 for 2 thus far. And here's the first pitch. Waits out the change up there as it's go 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 go, right go 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 out of here solo shot to right center his first homer so far in the series as they move on top four to nothing time to check the majestic home run tracker to see how far this ball traveled i mean this is the shot and as you can see it winds up an estimated 422 feet Number two will dig in. One for two with a double in this one. First pitch coming. Swinging a ground ball towards the middle. Base and hit. Dive by Green, but he can't get to it. A base hit. Well, take a look. It seemed to me he was expecting something off speed, but you see how well he's just. Maddox, old man. Jeff Blum will try it again. Set down on strikes his first time. 
Now a swing and look out as that just about drilled the first base coach. Really using that slider to his advantage in this at bat. It's 0-2. And a slider runs in on him as he has to lean out of the way. And let's see if that sets up the outside corner now. You're out. Off speed pitch, swung on and missed, and with that, the side is retired. Padres down in order. They're down 4 nothing. and you can see him stretch out as far as he can to pull this one in. Nice play. Here's the first pitch to him. And he misses inside with that one. Ball one. Two out with the man at first. Swing and a ball line hard towards Base the hit. No hesitation that time, rounding second, as he's going to hustle all the way to third on the base hit. Number 50 will be the batter. Two for three with a double thus far. Fastball, and oh, he has to bend out of the way of that one. And he's not afraid to run pitches inside on hitters. And a fastball in there for a strike, one and one. Go 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 Number 23 will get another crack, one for three thus far. Lined into left center. Big said, let's go, that's a double. Around first, heading for second now. And now this will rattle up against the fence. Far as he's really been in control here. Number 41 will try and turn it around. 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts thus far. And he gets ahead 0 and 1. Here's the pitch. Now a swing, but not much behind And the it pitcher is gets a base hit. Center. And that's going to fall for a base hit. Well, this isn't the greatest swing you're going to see. Pitchers don't get a lot of time in the cage, mind you, but this one works up. Jeff Blum will get another shot. Struck out swinging his last time. And that's cut on and missed 0-1. Still pitching well, but you can see he's starting to get pitches up and over the plate. Be careful. Grounded foul. Girl. And he struck him out. And there's the hat trick as that's his third. The super job of hitting right there. Tremel Sledge will try again. 0 for 3 thus far. Foul toward the third base dugout, but this will get back into the seats out of play. Got him to go after that one, and he's in a quick hold. 0 and 2. Ooh, tough to lay off there, but it's called a ball 1 and 2. Side, two balls and two strikes the count now. Just did get a piece of that one, so he stays alive here. Ready with another 2-2. Two -two. And he struck him out. So double digits now. Ten strikeouts for him thus far. Boy, and no factor up there with that swing. He was way late on the fastball. Number two. Go bad now. A couple of hits in four trips, including a double. Curveball is nowhere close, and it's 1 0. Oh. 
left it up in the zone, but it's a strike one and one. Just a challenge fastball right there, and he didn't want any part of it. Swing and a hot shot toward third. Base hit. Base hit. And that's now three hits for him in this one as he's on base again here with two out. And that the ball game is over. And you can bet they'd have liked to have done this at home in front of their home fans. They were the World Series. This is a moment you dream about from a very early age. So, Dave, as the new champs are being crowned, let's go back and have a look at our new era cap heads up play of the game. Well, Matt, you're going to see he just sits on this offering and sends it over the wall for a two-run shot that not only gave him the lead, but also gave him the momentum to carry this through to victory. Well, you want to J.D. Talk Martinez, the player of the game, one, one through five, a home run and two RBIs. Clinching game. Guys, he's our upper deck player of the game. Well, you said it right there, Matt. This is where it matters most. They say he's made, not born, and here's a prime example. He was on the big stage tonight and was the difference maker in this series victory. So that's it, the end of this so series. I mean, it was a short series, show. but it you was one that I loved to, to do. Uh, to do. Even though it was the Red Sox, I don't care about that fact as much. But yeah, uh, great series. Thank you so much for watching this video and this series. There will be a highlight video coming up soon uh, before Monday. Uh, click that like button, share this video on social media, and subscribe and hit that notification icon for more videos. See you guys next time with another video. Peace. Oh, and before that, you will see the... World Series MVP. So the World Series MVP is Mookie Betts batting 429, two home runs and six RBIs for this series. And for the playoffs MVP, it is also Mookie Betts batting 393, five home runs and 20 RBIs. He certainly got the job done in the playoffs. See you next time with another series. Peace.